Hi and welcome to Meet the Beat. Today is a special edition where we show you how to use your clay cooker or Romer Topf, which it is also called in German. As it is called in German, we show you how to use it, what to use it for, and give you tips and tricks. So let's get started. The first thing that you have to do before using your Romer Topf or clay cooker is to soak it in water for 20 minutes before using it. It is very important as the clay cannot be dry when you use it. When you then use it, it's very important that the oven your clay cooker goes into is entirely cold. It should not be preheated. So when you're going to use it, you turn up the heat in the second that you put in your clay cooker. The degrees that you want to use your clay cooker at in the oven is around 150 degrees Celsius to 200 degrees Celsius or in Fahrenheit that is around 300 to 390 degrees because the clay cannot take much more temperature than that. We always use this lovely clay cooker to braise our meats in. It's lovely for a meat that is usually not tender in itself. It can go tender by being in the oven. And uh, one of the thing about clay cookers is that they're usually going into the oven for quite a long time. It's often three hours or more. So of course using a clay cooker or a Romer top, it's not something you just do in 20 minutes. You cannot prepare a meal for your guests uh, that quickly. But if you do have all the day in front of you, you should definitely do it. It will always um, sort of make sure that your meat is going really tender. So if you want to um, impress your boss or your guests when they come over, this is sort of a no-fail way to cook. We always use uh, liquids such as red wine or beer or stock for our bracing. When we use the clay cooker, of course, you should not put in too much liquid. It's not like it's going to be a soup that it's soaking in the meat. It's more for um, covering a bit of it and extracting juice from the meat as well as adding liquid to a sauce that you can use because what we usually do here is that we, we take the sauce that is around the meat when we open the clay cooker and then we skim off the fats of the sauce and we add in a thickener and make a lovely gravy out of it that will accomplish the dish completely. Uh, we always serve these comfort food dishes uh, that we get from our clay cooker with mashed potatoes or fries or something like that. It's gonna always impress. So if you have clay cookers standing around in your cupboard and you don't know what to do with it, please use this guide as inspiration and we hope to uh, to be able to um, make that clay cooker something you can actually have use of. In the end, I just want to add that we do not receive any funding or anything from Romer Topf or clay cooker companies in general. We just really love to use it. See ya!